المزمل He that has wrapped himself up with the name of Allah, the most gracious, the ever merciful. O you that have wrapped yourself up in robes of prophethood, stand up in prayer at night except for a small portion of it, half of it, or you may however reduce it a little, or prolong it a little more, and keep on reciting the Qur'an distinctly and thoughtfully well. Verily, we are soon going to charge you with the enormous and important responsibility of conveying to people the message of your Lord. Verily, getting up at night for prayer is the most effective means of subduing oneself and the most upright way to acquire control over one's actions and speech. Indeed, you have a long chain of engagements during the day. Therefore, extol the name of your Lord and devote yourself to him with exclusive and sincere devotion. He is the Lord of the East and the West. There is no other, cannot be, and will never be one worthy of worship but he. Therefore, take him as disposer of your affairs, putting your full trust in him. And patiently persevere in the face of all that these enemies say, and withdraw from them in a graceful manner. Leave me to deal with those who belie the truth, and who are possessors of ease and plenty, and give them a little respite. We have a variety of fetters ready to bind them with, and a raging fire to throw them into, and food that chokes and a woeful punishment. That punishment will befall them on the day when the earth and the mountain shall quake, and the mountain shall crumble into heaps of sand dunes. O people, we have indeed sent a great messenger to you, who is a witness over you, just as we sent Moses as a messenger towards Pharaoh. But Pharaoh disobeyed the messenger, so we seized him with a terrible punishment, so all of you be on guard against such an attitude. But if you also disobey the messenger sent to you, how will you then guard yourselves from the calamity of the day which will turn even children prematurely gray-headed? And because of which the heaven shall be rent asunder, this is the promise of God. Remember, his promise is bound to be fulfilled. Verily, this Qur'an is a reminder. Therefore, let him who will follow the way leading towards his Lord. Surely your Lord knows that you remain standing to say night prayers for nearly two-thirds of the night, and sometimes half or one-third of it. And so, and so does a party of those of your believing companions who are with you. And Allah determines the night and the day. Sometimes the nights are long, and sometimes they are short, and sometimes the day and the night are equal. He knows that you, the Muslims in general, will not be able to keep up so long a vigil. He has therefore turned to you with mercy. Recite then as much of the Qur'an in your night prayer as is easily possible. He knows that some of you may be taken ill and others may be moving about in the land seeking Allah's bounty, and still others who may be fighting for the cause of Allah. So, O Muslims, recite as much of it as is easily possible for you. You shall, however, observe prayer regularly five times a day in all events, and go on presenting the zakat, and set apart a goodly portion of your possessions to give for the sake of Allah. And whatever good you send on before for yourselves, you will find it with Allah as the best of things, meriting the greatest reward, and seek protection of Allah. Verily, Allah is all-protecting, ever-merciful.